this is Nikki and I'm here to share the messages that I get and the guidance that I get from Spirit with you um, and the guidance that I get from to guide us back to unconditional love um, because if you're on the same journey and have been resonating with my messages then it is because we most definitely agreed to help each other before we came down here no doubt about it we have signed contracts with the people that are bringing us back together and um, the reason why I'm here is I'm in Greenwich and this is where I was guided to set up the crystal grid to um, harmonize the energies between the divine lovers and also raise love and light on the planet. And I come here to infuse a piece of the rose quartz to send out to, to whoever joins basically. And when you meditate upon that, it um, creates love and light and raises love and light on the planet. And the reason why I've been brought back here today is because A, I had to collect some more rose quartz and also I had to go and see, I actually went to see my twin this morning and basically he just, I mean it was just crazy. So the first thing is I was giving him a piece of rose quartz, although he knows nothing about twin flames, he does know that I do Reiki and he does also know that I do crystal healing. And so when I was giving him the rose quartz, I said, oh, I go to, um, he said, what are you doing now? And I said, oh, he, well, firstly, he said, is that going to heal me for eternity? And I was like, um, yeah, actually, it will. Um, and I was just really surprised that he said that. And then um, I said, oh, I'm going to Greenwich because that's where I go to work with the crystals. And he said, oh, do you go to the tree? where Elizabeth II sat and I was like no I didn't know it was there and he said oh I used to go there all the time because I used to live near there and I used to go up and sit at that tree anyway so I have now come to the so the reason why I say that is because it's obviously that their guidance that's guiding us back so I was due to come to go to Greenwich specifically to work with the crystals to put in the crystal grid and to send out to everyone that joins and so the fact that he just said that to me, saying that he used to come here and sit under this tree, is just blowing my mind a little bit because without a doubt, you are both working, you and your twin and your higher selves are working in unison together to bring you back together. Um, so whatever guidance you're getting, then know that it's guidance that's coming from both of your higher selves because your mission is to come back together um, and you know your mission for yourself is to raise yourself in love and light till you vibrate at the point um, that you can come back together till you're harmonized um, and part of that is finding out how you can raise love and light on the planet whether it be just sending out a simple love and light gesture and imagining all the world surrounding a pink cloud or whatever it is for you um, so the other thing two other things that I just was just blown away by because on the outside from a 3d perspective you would never think you know he, my um, twin is still in a three in a karmic relationship and just you know totally far away from from all the guidance that we're getting and all the messages but what happened was when he came um, I was saying um, he so I said that he there was basically a swan on the bridge so he had to wait to cross the bridge because there was a swan crossing the bridge. Now, if anyone knows about swans, it's a sign of spirituality. It's a sign of, um, it's actually, a, if you look up sh in shamanic healing, it's a very powerful pa um, spirit animal. And it's also swans mate for life. So he came to get me because he was like, Nick, look, there's a swan. I can't, you know, the swan is right there. And then he said to me, when I was on holiday, and he was in a foreign country. He said, there was a swan on the beach falling asleep. It was just like chilling out on the beach. And so we were laughing about it and talking about this swan. And then, you know, there was another swan here. And um, so all of these signs from the universe, um, constantly giving that reassurance and constantly giving those signals, right? That they are your divine partner and you are on your divine journey together. Um, so what I wanted to say was just that that has just given me unbelievable confirmation again that although they might not be fully aware of it, they're definitely, they're, their higher selves are definitely talking <laughs> to them and coming through. And um, just the swans and the fact that he actually came here 
and you know knew exactly the place where I did the crystals and I mean just crazy and then he said when I gave him the crystal it was is that gonna be with me for eternity or something he asked me and I was like well yeah it is so again amazing 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 messages um, I hope that these help you because I just want to you know I'm being guided to share a bit of my journey because I know that um, it is tricky but you have to have faith and know that it is coming um, they are definitely definitely I would say yeah I would definitely say from what I what I've been seeing and experiencing they are waking up whether they're whether they're subconscious I think they're definitely subconsciously aware anyway I hope that helps and I look at this stunning view and this is where Queen Elizabeth II is at the other amazing thing about that is is that obviously it's the king and queen because he said she came up here to look at her kingdom now um, if you know that we have to be coming into our Empress power for him to be the Emperor so again another sign there he actually used those words as well he said this is where the Queen used to come to look watch over her kingdom so you know they know at some level they definitely know all right well i hope that helps you and if you would like to join the crystal grid then please if you're drawn to it then you are most definitely being guided to join to spread love and light around the planet and also to harmonize the energies between yourself and your twin um, because it's amazing and the rose quartz when he looked at it he was like oh wow it's he actually said something nice about it which i was also quite shocked about <laughs> um so anyway if you yeah if you um, would like to join i'll leave all the details in the link and we'd love to have you okay thanks bye